Hi there, Great Twelves, and welcome to today's video in which we are now going to be looking at how to uh, modify the data series that the chart is actually based off of. So in our scenario here, we've got a chart that's showing us the number of learners in the school and the number of years they've been there uh, from 2014 all the way through to 2018. But let's say we don't want that. Okay, We don't want the years to display um, in the chart, but we do want the labels to change here according to these years. So what we're going to do is we're going to right click on our chart and we're going to go down to select data. Once we've clicked on that, you can see we have two series. Okay, we have one series over here represented by the blue and the second represented by the red. So let's take out the first series and see how that changes things. Ah, there we go. So now we can see that series one was showing us our years. But series two is actually showing us the numbers and we can see how that actually matches up to the numbers over there. So that's fine, right? We're going to go back into select data because now we've, we've now modified what we're actually basing all of this on. We want to click on series two because we want to change these numbers over here to actually show the years, right? So in order to modify anything in that, you can see it displayed over here. We need to click on edit on a horizontal category because that's the axis we want to mess with if I can put it that way and now I'm going to highlight the years over here because this is what I actually want to bring in and have a look there that's where you can see that and I'm going to click OK so now I've modified the data series that my chart is actually based on um, to show something a little bit different or to show it in a different way let's say I don't want 2014 and 2016 um, to show in my chart as well, you can see I can just edit it over there. I can also go back to where I was, click on my series to edit that. I can change the name, say new series, and I can even base it off another set of numbers, you know, or another set of data if I have that. Okay, so when I click OK, you can see it's now a new series and it also changes over there. Now, if I want this to change, and like we say, um, I can modify this over here and I could say maybe uh, school data. Click OK, and that's where it will change, right? Alternatively, if you don't want to do that and you just want to take that out, you can take the tick out of legend because that's what it is. It's a legend on the side there, right? Or we can even, you know, change where the legend is. Uh, will display okay but that's how we change um, and modify the data series that our chart is based off of